So like a doctor in making their rounds, we check out each plant to see sort of what's up with it. So here are our pepper plants and there's a couple of warning signs with these. One is all of their, a bunch of leaves have dropped on the floor, which is not normal. And then if we look at the leaves that are still on the plants, you can see a few of them that have these brown spots that then become more yellow and then the leaf gets totally yellow and it falls. So what I would do is I would pick off a leaf that looks like that. And then I would check the underside of it because that's where the bugs normally like to hide. So these guys suck the juice out of the leaves. So when you have an aphid problem, which is a common gardening problem, there's a couple of solutions. One is to introduce the ladybugs, though the issue with ladybugs is that they fly away. Um, so another solution is to use something called neem oil. This is neem oil extract. Neem is a type of tree that grows in Africa and the oil is produced by pressing the fruits and the nuts um, together to get the oil. So the way that the neem oil actually works is different than a regular oil, which you could use like an olive oil or something to spray your plants with. It smothers the leaves um, and smothers the bugs and they suffocate and they die. Neem oil does do that, but it has a different effect. When you spray the leaves and the bugs ingest the leaves, um, they get the neem oil in them, which makes them confused and actually forget to eat and forget to breed. So it just confuses them. Only if you spray it on the beneficial insects like ladybugs or bees or something like that, so you want to be careful. But once the neem oil is dried, it doesn't affect those bugs because they don't eat the leaves. So it only affects the bugs that eat the leaves, which makes it really awesome. No, it's not. I wouldn't go around eating this, but neem actually is a plant that was used in Ayurvedic medicine for all sorts of things. So. It's not an amazing thing to kill bugs, but if you have to make a choice, neem oil is a really good way to go.